In this equation, we have the thermal decomposition of calcium nitrate. We have the CaNO32, and it's going to break apart after it heated into these compounds here. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation to balance it, and we need to be very careful with this equation here as we do that. So we have one calcium, we have one nitrogen, and this two, we have multiplied everything here by two, so two times the one nitrogen, two nitrogens, two times three, six oxygens. On the product side, we have one calcium, one nitrogen, and then all these oxygens. We have one plus two plus the two here in the oxygen. So we have a total of five oxygens. Let's leave the oxygens till last and balance these nitrogens. I've got two here and one here, coefficient of two. So one times two, that balances the nitrogens and then we need to update the oxygens. We have the one plus two times two, that's four plus the two in the oxygen. So now we have seven oxygen atoms. Really at this point, since I have seven here and six here, I know that I'm gonna to have to have a bigger number here to balance it out. So I think I'm just gonna put a two in front of the calcium nitrate. Then I have to update all these numbers. So I have one times two, two calcium atoms, two times the one, the two nitrogens, times the two. So two times two is four, two times the three is six, times the two. Now I have 12 oxygen atoms. Let's balance the calciums. We're still leaving the oxygens to last. So I have two here and one here. If I put a two in front of the calcium oxide, one times two, that'll give me two. So those are balanced. Let's update the oxygens again. Two times the one, that's two, plus we have the four, and then the two with the O2. Now we have 10 oxygen atoms. We also need to update the nitrogen atoms. So let's do that. It looks like we have four here and only two here. So we need to double these. So we need to change our two to a four. So now we need to update the nitrogens and the oxygens. One times four, four nitrogens. Those are balanced. Then the oxygens, one times two, that's two, plus two times the four, eight, plus these two here, that's 10, 12. So we have 12 total oxygens and we're done. This equation is balanced. So the key really is to leave these oxygens to last when you balance the equation. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for the thermal decomposition of calcium nitrate, CaNO32. Thanks for watching.